Hello everybody! This video was brought to you by Verve. So you can check out the link in the description or just go to verve.co slash gb, g-i-b-i and get 30 days of ad-free Verve Premium. It's home to all of your favorite channels made by our friends over at Crunchyroll, so all of the anime you could ever dream of and they just added a bunch of Nickelodeon shows so they have Cat Dog, Wild Thornberries, Rocket Power, I Smell a New Roleplay coming up <laughs> and it's all accessible in one app that you can watch on your smart TV, on your computer, on your phone and with Verve Premium the best part is that you can do offline viewing by downloading your favorite shows to watch whenever you want. So make sure to check out Verve, link in the description, or go to verve.co slash gb. Thank you guys so much again for the incredible sponsor. I hope that you enjoy this My Hero Academia roleplay. If you still haven't watched it, please, it is the best show. And I hope you give it a chance. Um, but thank you guys and enjoy the video. Kaminari, Minita, get away. Oh. Hello? <sighs> Why did you fall asleep in your first class? <sighs> Look at what they've done to you. They drew things on your face. <sighs> My name is Momo. I am Vice President of Class 1A. And what's your name? Ah, well, as Vice President, I should know the names of everyone in class, but it's only been a few days and you're the new one, aren't you? Just came from the office. I suppose Terabyte can talk your ear off, can't she? Well, that's no excuse for falling asleep in class. I am here to give you your pop quiz. Well, Mr. Aizawa told me to hand them out to everyone. And, um, well, he's, he's the one sleeping on the floor over there. Anyway, here's your pop quiz. I suppose I can help you just this once. I already finished mine. Mm -hmm. Well, do you have a pencil? Why aren't you prepared? It's fine. No problem. My quirk allows me to create any non-living thing. So I'll just create one for you, all right? Okay. There we go. I hope you like the color red. Well, instead of just creating you one pencil, I took it upon myself to make you the whole pencil case. So now you won't ever have to lose any pencil pencils again. Do you prefer a regular pencil or ballpoint pen? Okay. Uh, this one's uh, mechanical. And then highlighters and ah, this is probably what you're looking for. Pretty bold to be taking a quiz in pen. I like it. Here you go. I also got you a pair of scissors as well. You never know. Alright. So, do you mind if I get the drawing off of your face? You look a little ridiculous. Oh, don't worry. Here, um, let me make a rag. Mm -hmm. Here we go. And we'll just go ahead and I 
like we're gonna have trouble with that one. I'm trying, but... Huh. I think we're gonna need something stronger. <sighs> no worries. I know just what to make. directly on your face. It'll work better that way. All right, well, close your eyes. Okay. And this is just gonna wipe away. There we go. That's a little better. Oh, it's coming right off now. Well, homeroom is one thing, but you wouldn't want to go to All Might's class looking like this. Not on your first day. Yes. I've met him. Mm -hmm. We had class with him already when you weren't here. He's incredible. Absolutely, just large presence. I've seen him on TV all the time and all that stuff, but when you see him in person, it's actually astounding. Okay. Much better. Children. Okay. Let's move forward with your pop quiz. Since you were asleep, I assume that you weren't paying attention. So, I don't want you to just copy my answers because then you wouldn't learn anything. So, I'll just give you a little bit of assistance. Okay. I don't want anybody falling behind in class. <clears throat> Question one. What's the passing rate for the Provisional Hero Licensing Exam? You know. You don't even know what the license is? Okay. The license allows you to um, be able to use your quirk in hero settings and be recognized legally. Well, most, uh, most first years don't take the test, but since we're at the rigorous and prestigious UA High will actually be taking the test this year. Probably with a lot of other second and third years from other schools, but don't worry, I'm sure they will prepare us. Okay, so the answer is a little higher. Higher. 50%. Write that down. And do you know when it's held? Twice a year, June and September. Okay. All right. Oh, question two. What is a provisional hero license? I just told you. Okay. Good. Good job. Oh, I love this. We should start a study hall. Will you be in my study group? You can come over to my house and everything. I'll have my maid call your maid. Okay. Um, number three. What's the name of the principal of UA High? You haven't met him yet. Well, I'll give you a hint. Nezu. N E Z U. Yeah. I suppose that wasn't really a hint, but you won't forget that again, will you? I don't think so. How many departments does UA have? Four. Right. Good job. Can you name them? Well, there's our department, the hero department. Then we have the B 
people who make things for us. Support. Mm -hmm. People who help market the heroes. Management. And then we have general education. Good job. Okay. This one's a little intense, but Mr. Aizawa went over it yesterday, so I'll, I'll fill you in. Um, what's the side effect of using a trigger? So a trigger is something that heroes take to boost their quirk. I'd actually never heard of it either. There's a really weird side effect. It turns your tongue black. Mm -hmm. um, I'll probably have to tell Mr. Aizawa that I helped you with this. I'm sure he's not expecting you to know all the answers. Maybe he is. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, speaking of Aizawa, Mr. Aizawa's capturing weapon, you see like the bandages around his neck, well, they're sort of concealed by the sleeping bag at the moment, but um, his bandages that he usually wears looks like a scarf. Do you know what they're made out of? This one was interesting for me. Well, it's actually um, carbon fiber and like a special metal alloy. No, it's not just ordinary fabric at all. I think I can make something similar if I tried. I need to know all of the properties and the makeup of any object I'm making. I do have a book. Yeah. That helps me a lot. I think if I were to make a costume, I would need to have, like, a shelf for my book. I'll have to remember that for later. We're going over costumes today as well. Exactly. Okay. Yeah, I didn't expect, uh, you know, the teachers at UA to be this lazy, but he's also a little scary, to be honest. Oh well. Wait till you have class with All Might. Number seven. What do you do when you first arrive on a rescue scene? Well, this one sort of applies to non-heroes as well. But we have to remember that, you know, victims, they're oftentimes very scared. That's right. So we have to keep them calm and check their medical status. Okay. If they're safe to move, transport them to safety. I think we're going to be going over rescue next week. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, that wasn't so bad. It's a short quiz. And I will hand this in when Mr. Aizawa wakes up. But for now, getting a little hungry. I'm just gonna make a little snack. You want any? Well, the more I eat, the more I can make. But when I make food, it doesn't really help. Here. Do you like yellow? I like the pink ones, but I haven't figured out how to make only one flavor yet. So, all I've been getting in this one is yellows. I suppose that'll have to do. So I can't tell from looking at you. What's your quirk? I see why you got into the hero school. Mm -mm. I've never met anyone else with that. Did you get it from one of your parents? Okay. 
that's awesome. Well, my quirk is called creation, as you probably figured out by now. But, um, when we come up with our hero names, I'm thinking something like Creative. It has a nice ring to it, right? Mm hmm. Well, it uses the lipids in my body, put simply enough. And like I said, all I need to do is know the molecular makeup of whatever I'm creating and out it comes. I can make quite big objects, like cannons or tarps, anything like that, but I need a large space on my body. So this uniform really isn't doing me any favors. Yeah, the skin has to be exposed. It's gonna be interesting when I have to create my costume. But the larger things uh, take longer to create, but something small like these, just a couple seconds. Have you always wanted to be a hero? That's awesome. Me too. I got into UA through um, official recommendations, actually. What about you? I didn't see you at the entrance exam. Hmm. You're a special case. Well, I have to make sure that I work hard, so I'm sure you feel the same way. Do you think about your hero name yet? Just a little. Yeah. Terabyte at the front office. She, um, she'll help you a little bit if you ask her. Mm-hmm. Same with the costume stuff, too. Oh, yeah. What are you most nervous about? <laughs> I see a lot of people struggling with, uh, the tests. But don't worry. Like I said, we can form a study group. <laughs> Everyone here has been practicing so hard, like, physically that, uh, you know, I think they forget that this is still school. Oh yeah, we have all of the regular classes as well. You got your schedule, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, I don't mind at all. Well, I was voted vice president, so it's my duty. Keep everything in check. Help out Ida. <laughs> exactly. And do you mind if I ask, um, where'd you go to school before? Oh! Bakugo and, uh, Izuku, they went there as well, didn't they? Interesting. Well, they seem to be childhood friends, but Bakugo is very nice to Midoriya. No, he's not. Um... So funny. But, um, do you want to see me make a Bakugo figure? Okay, one second. Don't let him see. Tell me if he's looking over here. Look how cute. I've managed to get his spiky hair just right lately. Well, this is the costume I imagine him in. We were talking a bit about it in class the other day. What people wanted to enhance their quirks. You want to keep him? Here. Oh, so this is actually his little grenade arm. If you haven't seen him in action yet. A lot of explosives. So his sweat will gather into the grenade and explode. Should we make one? Okay, this is a bigger object, so it might take me a second, but... think I should have been in the creation class. 
well, the support class with my creation quirk. Well, this is just a prototype. Okay, so what about your costume? We have to submit our ideas tomorrow. I'll help you. Yeah, let me grab my keyboard. Okay. Mm, this is what I made. It just plugs into your phone. Here, can I see? Okay. There we go. And perfect. Okay, so your cork. something that you'll want a little bit of a defensive cover for, to be honest. I think that could help you a lot. So as far as your hands, some type of gauntlet. I need to keep my hands pretty bare. Mm -hmm. Like I said, the more surface area for me, the better. Oh, I think this is so fun. I can't wait to meet people from the support class. <laughs> I feel like they'd be good friends. Okay. What about colors? Mmm, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm more... I like reds. I think I want something red. Definitely. Well, I can tell you that for your shoe covers, carbon fiber actually will be a very interesting choice. Mm hmm. Exactly. I've had to study a lot of materials, so when I was growing up, I would make my own clothes, but then I got in trouble a little bit, you know. I have to support the economy and purchase things rather than just make them. Yeah. It gets a little fuzzy with the law and such. So I try to do my part in spending my money and making the economy flourish. It's my duty as a citizen, after all. Okay. Well, what are you thinking in terms of a hood, anything like that? Helmet? Cap? Okay. Some of the stuff I think is just for show. I can't afford too much of that. I imagine some sort of wide belt. Um, I need a lot of uh, storage space, but it's going to be iffy because I want to have as much open as I can. I think around my waist would do very well. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Well. Well, I feel like that's, a, that's enough detail. Teacher should be totally fine with that. See? We're getting your homework assignments done already. I like to keep class as productive as possible. You know, where we're not really doing anything anyway. Some people tend to start goofing off, but everybody's really nice. I can introduce you to Jiro, uh, Mina, Tsuyu. There's some really, really nice people in class. <laughs> a couple of them intimidate me a little bit, but we're all in this together, right? Exactly. Well, it's almost time for our next class. And this one's with All Might. Here, let me, uh, let me make something for you. 
go. My gift to you for when you fall asleep in your next class. I'm just kidding. But, uh, you actually can keep him if you want. <laughs> you won't be falling asleep in the next class, though. Not with all might. Do you want to walk together? You have a couple minutes, but... Okay. Sounds great. Let me go collect everyone's tests, and then we can head out. Yeah. You can sit at the lunch table with us, too. Not such a bad first day. Okay. Here we go. And your first A. Okay. I'll be right back. You can uh, meet me at the door. <laughs> 